Good morning guys, this is Phil with Accelerate Roofing and Construction. I'm at a house down here by Camping World Stadium. Um, I met with this homeowner. Uh, she had a couple roofing contractors just said they just flat out weren't interested in this job. Sometimes when jobs are 20 squares, uh, 22 squares, some roofing companies may not be interested in the job. They said there was too much construction work on the home, so they weren't interested in that as well. So what I did is came and did my inspection. We're up on the roof today during our tear off. Uh, maybe it shows a couple of items that maybe some other roofing contractors may not be interested in taking on in such a smaller home. But to us at Accelerated Roofing, it doesn't matter if you have a 6,000 square foot home, or a 1100 square foot home. Every customer is valued. We wanna come in, we wanna do a good job and, and make sure that your, your home is taken well care of and you get a great warranty at the end of the process. There's a couple of things on this roof that um, were done. A contractor came in here without even pulling permits and things like that, did some construction issues. I wanted to kind of turn the camera around here and, and show you a little bit about some of those things. Uh, there's a couple areas of concern. So we've had to kind of like dig up some of the decking here. Uh, this actually looks okay. We're gonna replace some of the wood. You can see we had some rotted wood over here And my guys are renailing the decking every six inches. This is a Florida code requirement now We're replacing any damaged wood that we find any pipe penetrations if we have damaged wood We go ahead and replace that at the time. They have an interesting transition here uh, This was done during the renovation of this back side of the house um, they just kind of reframed it and left the old shingles. We're going to address that issue as well. Um, one thing I wanted to show you is sometimes people hire contractors that not necessarily are licensed or, in, or insured. I think this may be the case. So they ended up putting a new soffit here, a soffit extension to match the other side of the house. But you can see there's no two by four truss bracing here at all. So we're going to add that on there. I, I don't want to just hang off here with the camera. But this side here is actually kind of just dipping and falling off. You can see it's right here on this corner right here. It's kind of detached. This whole area is about to fall off of the roof where it meets their new extension here. So we're gonna adjust that, get that brought up to code, change out this wood, and make sure that this home has a roof on it for another 25 years plus without having any issues. This has a low slope area up here, so what we have to use is a modified bitumen. It's a little bit lower than two pitch on the slope here. Some more wood that we're replacing. And you can see on some of these older homes, they have plywood decking up here on the renovation side, and they have one by six um, boards on the bottom stage here. So we're getting all this cleared off. We're gonna end up putting new synthetic underlayment, uh, new Owens Corning Oak Ridge shingles, and then get this process started here. So uh, it's job too big or too small for us here at Accelerate. This is Phil with Accelerate Roofing and Construction. Appreciate you watching our videos. Until next time, thanks. Have a good day.